Hi VFC and welcome to this day 12 in our daily devotion series. Um, today's title is Receiving Fresh Revelation. Um, and we're going to be starting off in Joshua 5 and verses 13 to 15. And it says, When Joshua was near the town of Jericho, he looked up and saw a man standing in front of him with a sword in hand. Joshua went up to him and demanded, Are you friend or foe? Neither one, he replied. I am the commander of the Lord's army. At this Joshua fell, fell with his face to the ground in reverence. I am at your command, Joshua said. What do you want your servant to do? The commander of the Lord's army replied, Take off your sandals, for the place where you are standing is holy. And Joshua did as he was told. You know, in Joshua 5, Joshua was on the brink of attacking the fortified city of Jericho when he encountered a divine messenger on the road with sword in hand. In that moment, Joshua did not know if the divine messenger was on his side or if he was on the side of the enemy. When the messenger announced that he was the commander of the Lord's army, Joshua immediately recognised that he was sent by God and he fell down on his face in worship and reverence. Receiving a breakthrough begins with fresh revelation of who God is. And in the midst of a difficult situation, God desires to reveal himself strong. So if you're believing for financial provision, God desires to reveal himself as your provider. If you are believing for healing, God wants to show himself as your healer. When we receive a revelation of who God is to us, we receive the, the assurance that he knows and understands all that we're going through. How does God reveal himself to us? One way that he does so is through the Holy Spirit. In Ephesians 1 verse 17, Paul describes the Holy Spirit as a spirit of wisdom that helps us grow in our knowledge of God. When we ask the Holy Spirit, he gives us a fresh revelation of who God is in our lives. Don't just seek God, though, only when you need him. In all you do, begin by first asking the Holy Spirit to give you a fresh revelation of who he is. Desire to know him more personally and intimately. Purpose in your heart to seek God first before taking any step ahead and hear him tell you what he wants you to do. So as I put the song on now, I just want you to reflect. You know, God's word reveals who he is. Cultivate the habit of reading and meditating on God's word daily and allow God to reveal, you, reveal to you his, his character and his attributes. Is there a situation or challenge that you are facing now? Encourage and strengthen your faith in God by asking him for a fresh revelation of who he is. One we've got the Lord most high Your hidden glory in creation Now revealed in you our Christ What a beautiful name it is What a beautiful name it is The name of Jesus Christ my God what a beautiful name it is Nothing compares to this What a beautiful name it is The name of Jesus you didn't want heaven without us so Jesus, you brought heaven Sin was great, your love was greater 
What could separate us now? What a wonderful name it is. What a wonderful name it is. The name of Jesus Christ, my King. What a wonderful name it is. Nothing compares to this. What a wonderful name it is. The name of Jesus. What a wonderful name it is, the name of Jesus. Death could not hold you, the veil tall before you, you silence the boast of sin and grace. The heavens are roaring, the praise of your glory, for you are raised to life again. You have no rival. You have no equal now and forever, God. You reign. Yours is the kingdom. Yours is the glory. Yours is the name above all names. What a powerful name it is. What a powerful name it is. The name of Jesus. Christ, my name. What a powerful name it is. Nothing can stand against. What a powerful name it is. The name of Jesus. What a powerful name it is. The name of Jesus. What a powerful name it is. The name of Jesus. What a powerful name yeah, 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 yeah. What a powerful name Oh, death could not hold you so Silence the boast of sin and grace. The heavens are roaring, the praise of your glory. For you are raised to life again. You have no rival, you have no equal. Now and forever, God. Yours is the King, the glory. Yours is the name above all names. What a powerful name it is! A powerful name it is. The name of Jesus. So, Father, I know that you're. We know that you're active and present in our lives and that you desire to reveal yourself to us through the Holy Spirit. So give us a fresh revelation of who you are in our lives and give us the courage to take a step of faith in anything that you ask us to do. In Jesus' name, amen. Thanks guys, I'll see you next time.